Hello and welcome back to Sid Meier's Civilization 5 and uh, we are, as always, the Shoshone. And we're back. Right, so, where do we leave off? Um, uh, yes, okay, so stuff is happening, yes. Can you tell though I'm completely up to the minute on this? No, I'm not. <laughs> we, let me see, we were working on our World Congress and we are looking at increasing our um, influence by enacting the world order of, I would say, world ideology of order. Mm hmm. Apparently, we're not allowed any happiness from gold. Well, that's interesting. Uh, do I actually have gold? I wonder if I have access to gold. Hmm. Would it still show up even if we're not allowed to trade it? I have no idea. Or, if it, or rather, if we're not allowed any happiness from it. I have no idea. I don't think we do. I don't think we have gold. I think one of the others has gold. Um. Hmm, and how far off are we now? We are turn 455. I'm not sure if this is a 500 turn game or or something. I, I can't be that far off now. This is 2027 AD. We are in the future. So, um, it can't be that far. Um, in terms of victory conditions, I don't think anybody is particularly... Uh, dominant at the moment. Um, no one's completed the Apollo program. The United Nations has not yet um, begun. Um, no one's really got a cultural sort of... I don't know. What did it show me? Apparently we're 47.9% influential over Poland. I'd like to up that. I don't know quite how high that needs to go before it sort of tips in our favour. And hmm, uh, ah, the Inca Control Three Original Capitals. Interesting. I control two, so that's a little insurance at the moment. Um, although I'm sure if the Inca really wanted to, they could come over and, and give us a good stomp. Um, in terms of score, yeah, but it's not amazing. So that's where we are at the moment. Let's continue. Uh, uh, no, for a moment I thought something had revealed the whole map and then I realised that no, I actually did explore all of the sea areas. Um... Yes, Apollo, I think, gives uh, takes away all the uh, uh, cloud cover and basically shows us all the terrain. I think that's right. I don't need the hex grid thing, thank you. Um, and let me just check the diplomacy situation. Are we actually at war with anybody? Uh, we are not, I don't believe we are at war with anybody, so that's good. Um, oh, repeal the embargo over Indonesia. Ah. Now, I, I thought I had the measure on that. But apparently I didn't. And order, yes, well, that was nine from us. 9, 3, and 3, so that's 15, and stacked against me was 7, 10. Hmm. It almost feels like some people didn't quite use their votes. Not sure. Okay, so we get to make a uh, proposal. So, we now have 15 delegates, which is nice. Um... So at the moment we've got all of these. I don't particularly think we need to. Oh, embargo the Inca. Oh, okay. 
Um, let's take a look. Uh, we can't have any of that lot. Historical landmarks ever would upset everybody. Science funding would apparently upset everybody, apart from Egypt, who is, yeah, a little bit stuck on their own. Arts funding uh, would be great for everybody apart from Egypt. I don't really care what Egypt thinks, really. Uh, national heritage. Plus five culture won't work. Yeah. Cultural heritage. Egypt would not like. International games. Ah. Mm hmm. Tourism increases by 100% for 20 turns in a free social policy. Ah. Happiness, one time increase of 30 on influence with city states. Well, I think I've got most of them under my sway already, although more, more influence is good. Plus three happiness. Hmm. International games sounds good. Especially since we've already um we've already shown once that we can actually uh we can actually crank out the production when needed. So yeah, that's that's a strong possibility at the moment. Um yeah. Standing army tax new uh banning a luxury no. Uh embargo to be honest there's no one I want to embargo at the moment. Embargo city states no, because, yeah, I'm doing loads of trading now. I want to start trading with the city. In fact, I lifted an embargo against the city-states. Uh, embargo Austria. Uh, would anger Poland. And at the moment, Poland is who we're trying to be influential, influential over. Um, embargo the Inca. No, that makes sense in a way. Leaving that in place because they're the ones going around and stomping on everybody. Scholars and residents. Yes, we like that because it makes it easier for us to research things that other people have. Okay, international games. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. Yeah. In the meanwhile, we are exploring uh, Inca territory. And we are very much uh, coming to the conclusion... That there's a great big mountain range here, uh, which is interesting. Huh. And poor Austria is basically stuck with a single city of uh, Vienna. My, 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 indeed. Um, so Austria is easy pickings. Um, Egypt? Egypt? Is Memphis the original capital? I'm not sure if it is or not. I'm not sure if it is at all. Um, no, it's not. Thebes is. Mm. You see, now this is the only thing. If I was going to, going to go for a domination victory, yes, there's probably a couple of capitals I could pick off, but I then have to go against the Inca. Hmm, maybe not. Maybe not. We did recently expand into here. Grabbed a bit of te the te territory, so that is nice. I, I'm thinking of grabbing that square there, just to sort of circle Monaco. Poor Monaco. Uh, Monaco is the one city-state that I don't think we've actually... Uh, yeah, that we haven't managed to grab hold of yet. Neither likes or dislikes. Need another 54 influence to surpass. Yes, okay. Everybody else, I do believe we are allies. Yes, yes, and yes. And uh, very little sign in the short term of... Uh, of that dropping, I think I think the turning point was finding the uh, El Dorado. <laughs> there was a couple of city states that wanted me to find, uh, or what, uh, whatever you want, want to call these things, um, and uh, archaeological site. I, I don't remember, but anyway, I found one. As a result, they all got really happy with me. And if uh, and if it wasn't an ally, it was very easy to tip them, tip the balance over, and become an ally. 
Uh, so... Don't think there's an awful lot to do at the moment other than carry on this little uh, exploratory path. And uh, can we actually go into... We can't go into uh, Vienna, can we? Hmm... Ah, oh, you said. Yes, it's me. Um... You said that? No, I didn't think you would. Bit. Yeah, 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 okay. Okay, you don't like me. I know, I know. Um, hmm. Oh, aircraft, yes. That's a good point. That is a very good point. How are we on technology? How are we on technology? I think we were heading towards... Hmm. What we were heading towards... Do apologise to those who are obviously watching this video right after the last one and, and thinking to himself, he's, he's lost the plot. It's been a number of weeks since I've actually recorded a batch of uh, Civilization. Um, it's one of the few games I have been recording in, uh, in batches rather than sort of scrambling for the odd video here and there. Ah, anti-tank. Ah, yes. I think they should un I upgrade into anti-tank. Uh, Pikemen, unfortunately, uh, upgrade into Lancers. Lancers upgrade into... You know what? I'm not entirely sure. Um, hmm. I'm sure that's a search box. Yes, it is. Uh, upgrades into anti... Oh, that uh, upgrades into anti-tank gun. Oh. Okay. So what does uh, artillery? Um, done it again. Shoshone. Ah, oh, okay. Um, artillery. Okay, units. Unit begins of A. Renaissance, maybe? Modern? Good gravy, what are you? A Shoshone Artillery. That's what I thought. That is what I thought. Pathfinder, Comanche Rider. Hmm... Units. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Hmm. Yeah, the Shoshone. Uh huh. Not the Pathfinder. Land ship. Tank. Um. Hmm. That's not actually what I wanted to do. Ah, uh, you know what? Let's not uh, let's not uh, worry too much about that, shall we? I'm going to go over there somewhere, and uh, we shall continue. Right, choose production. Oh, yeah. Mm. Let's 
go for a workshop, because why not? Uh, trade. So many choices now. So many choices. Um, and yeah, changing. Yeah, well. Uh, let's go with Antwerp. Why not? Artillery. Oh, there we go. Artillery. Right. Not quite sure why I couldn't find any of those menus. Uh, upgrades with rocket artillery. Oh, right. Okay. Uh, requires rocketry. Rocket man. Rocket man rocketry. So, after we've done combined arms... Let's uh, scoot into rocketry, why not? Might as well upgrade what we can. In the meanwhile, just get back in there. I know, I know. Just, just, just chill. Uh, making very slow progress over here. Genghis Khan has completed the Manhattan Project. That's interesting. That is, and he seems to have a war with uh, Antwerp. Uh, yeah, we're not going to worry too much about that at the moment. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. This is going to get interesting pretty quick. I'm running around with uh, the odd Great War infantry, and everybody else is uh, getting ready to drop uh, nuclear bombs on each other. Uh -uh. I'm about as well equipped as the oh, Great War. Oh, yes, of course. That's what I was producing. Great War Bomber. So, order an airstrike. Okay. That's interesting. Uh, rebase. So, can I rebase at uh, Washaki? Maybe. So, yeah, order a rebase. We're shaky. Does that work? I don't know if that works or not. Um, hmm. well, I might as well go for another one of those. Finish the Great War Bomber. Okay, so... Uh, uh, do another Great War Bomber, because, hey, why not? Promote a unit. Ooh. Yeah, Siege, yeah. Unit needs orders. Can we uh, rebase you at Twishaki? Oh, we can. Okay. That is cool. Uh, and what about you? Uh, any of those places up there, but we can't quite stretch. Okay, so we can't quite reach there. So if we rebase here... And then we can go over afterwards, can't we? Okay. This works. Can I purchase a settler? I can. Yeah, you just stay there for now. I'm not quite sure who I might be uh, launching an attack against yet, but um, you never know. What does Monaco want from the world? Great merchant or uh, build the nibbish 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 nibbism. Oh yes, of course. Which I think I'm actually trying to do here. And it's going to take about 99 turns. 
<laughs> so that's not going to happen before the end of the game, is it? Not unless it's a uh, 750 turn game, which I'm kind of hoping it's not. Any man who can drive safely while Combustion. kissing a pretty girl is simply not giving the kiss the attention it deserves. Good on you, Albert. You tally tally tears. Uh, let's stay there for now. Settler. You want to come out to here. Uh, you can rehouse in Washiki. Shaky, shaky. And uh, this will be interesting if uh, if we decide that uh, Austria needs to be taken down, which I can see that being a possibility. Typically at this point, my phone has just burst into a huge pile of uh, you have emails and notifications. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Welcome to uh, Mongol territory. So we're slowly starting to uncover all this now. Um, we kind of want to go around these guys. Let's get onto the road, or the track, I think that is, actually. Great War Bomber. You just stay there, because not much for you to do. Uh, but uh, out of interest. At, out of interest. If it was going to bomb some... Oh, oh right. Not quite. I see. I see. Right. I would need to get closer. That is uh, disappointing. That is very disappointing. Um. Hmm. We can just about touch the uh, tentacles there, but um. Yeah. I can't see this one being much better either, if we have a city there. So a little bit limited. Uh, I could certainly take out uh, Lods, but um, but then, you know, we're kind of sort of friends with Poland at the moment, I think. He's friendly with me, so yeah. Uh, what have you got? You got anything interesting? Not really. You've stopped asking me, asking me for a defensive pact every 10 seconds. I noticed that. It was always very annoying. He kept asking for a defensive pact and then he'd go and have a squabble with the Austrians. And because he started the squabble... Anyway. Mm-hmm-hmm-hmm. <laughs> Just like my allies are basically fighting each other. Hmm. Wonder if I can actually. Uh, there isn't really any way you can sort of ask one ally not to pick on another, is there? It's a pity that. Now, would we even there be close? Yes, he would be close enough. Lovely. Whoops, I didn't want that. Um, we'll sneak around this way and we'll try and find out what's happening over there. You need these orders. Well, I'm for, oh, 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 we sneak around. Excellent work. Excellent. Well, I think it's pretty conclusive. There is no hidden uh, additional city in the middle of this little area. So I am somewhat amazed that Vienna hasn't already been swallowed into the uh, Incan Empire. Hmm. Good, good. Oh, 
Ooh. Oh. The anchor has now become the uh, oh, I see. Okay. Gonna have to uh, up the ante, I think. Which might be a little difficult, but um. Mm, and that's the best we can do, I think. I can maybe pull into this area and ca catch a bit of mounting, but um, we can, however, do that. Uh, establish trade route with. Um, right now, I'm basically not um, not relying on any of the uh, the big sieves. Um, let's keep it simple for now. So what have we got now? 14 turns until World Congress convenes. Okay. Geneva desires citrus and Sydney seeks investors. Antwerp wants Leventer bullied. Oh, I'll go talk to the barbarians then, because, you yeah. know. Uh, uh huh. Pop into there. Pop into here. Well, that exposes a little bit more, but still leaves. There's obviously nothing of interest underneath here. It's just going to be mounting. Hmm. I find it amusing that the Polish have uh, influence over this little area over here, even though they don't actually have a route to it. You think mountains would be like a natural barrier that a border 